Hello, people. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are Hi, you? Teacher. Good evening. Hello, hello. Yes. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Okay, people, let's get it started tonight. So, um, let's take the first attendance. Yeah. Oh, and when I call your name, I would like you to Tell me a little bit about your weekend. How was your weekend? What did you do on your weekend? Okay. So think about that. Are you ready? Few, few words. How was your weekend? Okay. Uh, for example, I could tell you that my weekend, uh, well, on Saturday, I, I got up late and in the afternoon I worked and on Sunday I went to church in the morning and in the afternoon I went to visit uh, my sister, one of my sisters, and I hadn't seen them for years, and I went to visit her. So that was my weekend. What about you? What did you do on your weekend? Anna Lillian, first say okay. present, and they'll tell me a little bit about your weekend. Great, teacher. Um, my weekend was en Saturday, eh, Sunday, perdón, este, en my work. You work on Sunday? Yeah. Oh. En, este, ay, ¿cómo digo domingo? Ya se me olvidó. Ah, Saturday. Sunday. Saturday and Sunday. Oh, Saturday trabaj. Eh, my work and Sunday and visit and my mother and and when the supermarket. Okay, good. Brian Javier Carmona. 
Hi, teacher. Good night. Good evening. Good evening. Uh huh. How was your weekend? Oh, in my weekend, I I work it on, on Saturday. Um, on, on morning, um, I'm sleeping uh, late. Mm -hmm. um, and Sunday, I I was watch uh, my ten play soccer. Oh, I don't. Okay. I don't play soccer, teacher. You didn't play. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay, thank you. Dinora Alejandra Alfaro. Present teacher. Hi, Dinora. How was your weekend? On Saturday, I went to eat pizza with my family, and in the afternoon. Uh, we were to the park with my niece mm -hmm. and on Sunday I went to church and I ate pasta with my family and okay. that's it. Okay, good. Uh, Frida Janine Mejia. Hello everyone. Hello, Frida. How was your weekend? I had a very busy weekend. And Sunday I worked, but before I went to the church where okay. my husband went as a child, a child. And I need the teacher <laughs> and his wife. Yeah, we were there. I also visited my mother and we went to eat chilate together. Oh, good. Okay, thank you, Frida. Javier Aldair Escobar. Hi, teacher. Hello, Javier. How was your weekend? Uh, my weekend. I was study um, to take a test. Um, I was also study for some parciales. And uh, so I was a little bossy. Uh, in the end, my weed was worried. No. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. Um, Jose Arnoldo Mazariego. Present teacher. Hi, Arnoldo. How was your weekend? Saturday in the morning, I work. In the afternoon, I go to San Salvador and buy the, the 15 years party dress for my, for my daughter. Oh. Um, yesterday in the morning, I going to the church with my family. After going to San Salvador, and we eat in eat China's uh, Hunan China's food. Mm -hmm. um, after going to the zoo, um, I return Santa Ana at 8 o'clock p.m. No okay. more. Okay, very busy. Jose Galileo Barrera. Present. Hi, Galileo. How was your weekend? Hi. Uh, the same routine on, on Friday after my job, I was driving from San Salvador to Sulutan, uh, I slept with my wife, my child in Sulutan. Uh, after day, Saturday, 
we were my wife and my child. We were uh, to the Sultan City. Uh, we buy it in supermarket and just looking around the town of Sultan and buy the, some juice. Uh, after return to home and at night my wife was working in the Tiglisco hospital oh. and, and Sunday uh, I went for my wife and go again got went we went again to Sultan City uh, take a, we took a breakfast and after and finally at noon I was returning to San Salvador yeah there's a, a the same routine but I like that routine because I spend my time with my family. Okay, okay, good. Jose Jonathan Vigil. Hello, present. Um, on Saturday morning, I clean, I clean up uh, at the home, was the well, um in the afternoon i visit my family um on saturday uh, i visit some friends for lunch um, later in the afternoon i went to play basketball okay jose rodrigo hernandez jose rodrigo not here yet. Okay. Uh, Catherine Marcela Castaneda. Hello. Hello, Catherine. How was your Hello, weekend? Teacher. Well, on Saturday, I work in the morning and then I cleaned my house and I watched a movie with my family and then we met we ate Mexican food. And Sunday, I visit uh, La Puerta del Diablo for the first time. And mm. I ate pupusas in Planet de Renderos. And then we return to, to home. Okay, very good. Laura Carolina Vigil. Laura, it's not here yet. Uh, Maria Concepcion Cerón. Maria Concepcion Cerón. Present teacher. Okay, Mary, how was your weekend? Uh, on Saturday, um, for the morning, I work. And in the afternoon, I spent it at home. Uh, watching TV with my baby. Um, on Sunday, visit the short in, in for the morning. In the afternoon, take a nap and finish by iron all the closet for the week. Okay, very good. Maria Ivania Palma. Present teacher. Hi, Ivania. How was your weekend? Saturday morning, I was working in the afternoon at seminary. On sun Sunday, I was cleaning and resting. Or sleep. <laughs> oh, casi no se le escucha, Ivania. Ivania. Hello. Hello. 
Casi no se le escuchó. Hello. Hoy sí. Ah, un poco mejor. Saturday morning, uh -huh. I was working in the afternoon at seminary. Study. Mm -hmm. On Sunday, I was cleaning. Okay. <laughs> sleep for uh. the afternoon. Sleep. Okay, good. Mauricio Antonio Orellana. Hi, teacher. Uh, hey, hello. Welcome back. Oh, thank you. Uh, I have permiso. No sé si ah, le comentaron. No sé si no, le comentaron. No, uh, they didn't tell me anything, but that's fine. Okay. You know, this weekend I have to work to do two, two days or all, all day. This, the last week was uh, heavy for for Tingu. It was uh, heavy. Okay. Pero ya gracias a ellos ya salimos de lo que teníamos. Okay. Okay. Good to see you again. Mauricio Antonio Rivera is not here. Mayra Veralice Moreno. Not here. Rocío Lourdes Pimentel, no. Zaira Marleni Larín. Present teacher. Hello, Zaira. Hello. How was your weekend at the hotel? Hi, teacher. I did my weekend working. Uh -huh. And what did you do at work? Tell a couple of things. What what did you do at work? Yes, um, the the hotel is almost full. Okay. Um, I I had a lot a lot of work. Okay. Okay. And my Wendy Maribel Zabaleta. Present teacher. How was your weekend, Wendy? Um, Saturday in the morning. I'm going to go work. Mm. Um, Saturday in the afternoon. Ah, when when supermarket with my mother. Mm. And Sunday, uh, when when uh, Pollo Campero mm -hmm. a a breakfast okay. with my mother. Okay. And in, in Sunday in the afternoon with church. Okay. Very good. Very good. Okay, people. Let me tell you a couple of things. Um, están mezclando algunos de ustedes el verbo to be en pasado con verbos en presente para decirme yo fui me están diciendo I was go para decirme yo vi me están diciendo I was see por ejemplo Eso no es correcto. ¿Cómo debe de decirme yo vi o yo fui? A ver, ¿y Javier? ¿Dónde está Javier? Ahí estás. Ok. A ver, ¿cómo decimos yo fui al 
supermercado. I go to supermercado. No. I go I to supermercado. I went. I went. I went to the supermarket. ¿Verdad? Ya. Yeah. Ya se, le, se los he dicho varias ocasiones. No mezclemos el verbo to be. Eh, la, la única forma, y algo otros lo hacen. Eh, a ver, por ejemplo, me dijeron algunos. On Saturday I was working. Quisiera yo pensar, y voy a darles el beneficio de la duda, que me están diciendo yo estuve trabajando. Pero si en su mente está, yo trabajé y me dicen I was working, eso no es correcto, ¿verdad? Y sobre todo, cuando se les está preguntando de una actividad ya terminada en el pasado, no es I was working, se dice I worked, ¿ok? On Saturday I worked. ¿Verdad? Porque yo diría I was working eh, when you called me. Yo estaba trabajando cuando tú me llamaste. Pero usualmente una actividad que se hizo en el pasado y terminó en el pasado es I worked. I worked on Saturday. ¿Verdad? Eh, algo otros me mezclaron el going, el eating. Para hablarme en pasado. Eh, eh, son cosas que ya deben estar manejando. ¿Ok? Solo eh, enfóquense un poquito a la hora de, de armar una frase. ¿Ya? Ya este tipo de frases son frases cortas que les estoy pidiendo. ¿No? ¿Qué hicieron? Pero me usaron a I going to the church. O sea... I went to church. Por ejemplo, no, 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 no recuerdo exactamente las frases que usaron. Estoy poniendo otro tipo de ejemplos, pero de esa forma usaron las estructuras. ¿Verdad? Eh, recuerden que cuando estamos hablando en pasado, hemos dicho el verbo en pasado. ¿Verdad? Yo comí. I ate chicken. I ate eh, eh, pizza, I ate pupusas. No, I was eating pupusas. O I was ate pupusas. O I was eat pupusas. Ok, una oración en el pasado es el verbo en pasado. ¿Ya? Eh, entonces, eh, eh, recordemos eso, ¿verdad? Traigamos eso de nuevo a la memoria, por favor, ¿no? A la hora de hablar en pasado, pues, usemos los verbos en pasado, y verbo en pasado es verbo en pasado, no me le metan el was, el where, ¿no? Si estamos hablando de actividades ya hechas, concluidas, el verbo en pasado y punto. ¿No? I worked, I ate, I visited, I, I uh, went, ¿ok? Ya eh, eh, metámonos eso ahí, ok. Creo que tendré que estar reforzando esto y preguntándoles de nuevo: ¿qué, qué hiciste ayer? ¿Qué hiciste la semana pasada? ¿Qué, eh, eh, por lo menos esta semana, para que lo vuelvan a recordar. Ok, sí. de acuerdo. Hola. Uh, you said in expression, in expression, o past, past expression. Is the, the past, the verb in past directly. Yeah, in, uh, in these particular uh, sentences, okay, there are many forms to talk about past. But, but, but okay, dime. Yeah, I, I don't understand when you said uh, don't speak with was or where. I, I am a little confused. Okay. Because in my speaking, I was talking about uh, using uh, was, where. Uh, mm -hmm. I, I am a little confused. 
Okay, so we use, that. that is what we know as past continuous. When we talk about a continuous action in the past, okay? Saturday morning, I was working. Okay, uh, but usually we use that um, to describe in relationship to other activities. But when I ask you, okay, what did you do on last weekend? I was going to, uh, for example, I don't remember if you used this sentence, but for example, if you said, I was going to Sulutan. No, uh, is I went to Sulutan. Okay, mm -hmm. because I was going to start diciendo, yo estaba yendo a Usulután. Mm -hmm. No, no es el, el sentido correcto. Okay. Porque tú no estabas yendo, tú fuiste mm -hmm. a Usulután. Es, es, es simple pass, es in, una acción that, que comenzó case, y terminó en el pasado. In that case, I said, uh, I was driving from San Salvador to Usulután. The correct expression so is I I drove to Sultan. I drove. Uh -huh. I drove. Uh -huh. It is much much is more simple. Yeah, it's in specific because you're talking about an action that is finished, is done. Yeah. 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 So uh, uh so remember, so I was doing is estaba haciendo. Y tú no lo estabas haciendo, tú lo hiciste. Ok. Ok, es algo que yo hice. Uh, a, a excepción que estés hablando de otras cosas. Uh, ok, I, I, yo estaba viendo el partido cuando se fue la luz. Es, es otra forma, ok, estás diciendo otra cosa. Okay. Ya. Yeah. Entonces ahí, I was watching TV or the, or the game when the power got off. Ok, so. Es es good to know it. Thank you. Okay, so simple past is simple past. So the verb in past and that's it. it it's easier. I got okay. it. And, and remember, it. Yeah. And, and remember the, the verbs in past because some of you use the verbs, but in present. Yo compro. En lugar de decir yo compré, por ejemplo. Entonces son detallitos que hay que, hay, que, hay que recordar, hay que pulir. Ok. Muy bien. So, hay que calentar motores después del fin de semana, ¿no? Veo que tú, estuvo algunos muy ocupados. Ok. ¿Any other question about that? ¿Otra pregunta acerca de eso? I have... Uh... Uh, some errors in my in my description, but but in I use the I travel to San Salvador. This is correct. Traveled. Traveled. Yeah. 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 You can use I, it. In a, in a one in a one sentence, I use I going. Um, yeah. this, is, uh, this, is an, uh, this is an error mm -hmm. yeah uh, I try to, uh, for the future uh, I try to, to correct this, this error perfect that's the idea that's the idea Thanks. to improve 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 okay Thanks. okay people well tonight is going to be an easy lesson I guess I guess Let's see. This last class we were talking about there is, there are. Okay. Um, I'm having an issue here. Well, yo me voy a dirigir por esto. Okay, we are going to, to jump to page 25 today because 
there is an error in the book, in the material, so they didn't put everything together correctly. And the exercises in the platform, because the next lesson is page 23 and 24. That is the next lesson. But the exercises in the platform are not difficult, but the exercises in the platform are based on lesson on page 25 and 26. Okay, also the title of the video in platform, in the platform is for pages 25 and 26. Okay, so we are going just switch. Solo vamos a hacer ese intercambio. No vamos a saltarnos la página 23 y 24. Eso lo vamos a ver mañana. Porque en el orden del que trae la plataforma, lo que hay que ver es, es lo que está en la 25 y 26. Ok. Eh, y mañana vemos lo de la 23 y 24. Para seguir el orden que tiene la plataforma. Um, because to a page 25 and 26 then. So we're going to start there. Talking about a be not allowed. That is the that is the topic for tonight. Okay. Let's see. So take a look to page 25. In tonight's lesson, you will be able to mention rules and prohibitions at your workplace. Rules and prohibitions at your workplace. Okay, so first question. What are some rules in your company? Tell me about that. Tell me at least, well, not at least, only. I know you may have a lot, but tell me one rule in your company. Come on, one, one by one. Uh-huh, Dinora? Don't use cell phones. Don't use cell phones, okay. Arrive early. Arrive early. Do not, ¿cómo se dice divulgar? Be, Do not. Divulgar. Divulgar. Divulgar, eh, ¿qué cosa? ¿Cómo qué? Eh, confidential information. Um, yeah, because divulgar, I think is divulgate or tell or, um, well, yeah. no, do not tell do, confidential. Do not share. Share. Confidential information. Do not share confidential information. Okay. What else? Another rule in your workplace? Yes. Uh, a net on hell in okay. the production area. Okay, where? Remember when we talk about clothes and things that you put on your body, we use the verb wear. Where? Uh huh. Wear a net on your head, okay, in the production area. Uh huh. Come on, give me more. I'm asking give only the, one. Give uh -huh. the safety, give the safety industrial. Okay, okay. What else? Rules. Tell me. I don't believe you don't have rules. Uh huh. The good use equip. Uh, good use computer. of equip equipment. 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 Yes, okay. Good use. Equipment. Good use of equipment. Okay. Equipment. Come on. I want to hear at least one from everyone here. Follow HSE protocol. Okay. Uh huh. What else? Brian, Saira, Javier, Mauricio, um, Mary, we're, Laura. We're done. We're done. Uh, another. Play, workplace. Repeat, repeat. We are done. Um, 
No, no estar en otro espacio de trabajo. Ah, come on. ¿Cómo podemos decir eso en inglés, people? Ayudémosle, Javier. No estar en otro lugar de trabajo. Keep Debo your estar. own place. ¿Cómo? Keep your own place. Keep your own place. A work. Don't uh, move to other side. Don't move to other uh, side or other place. Okay. Stay in your workplace, on your work spot. Okay. Rules. A ver. Don't eat in the office. Don't eat in the office. Yeah. Well, you, can you eat at, at work? In my case, yes. Oh. <laughs> coffee. Coffee <laughs> with bread, fruit. Oh. Great. My boss and my boss and I. Okay. I eat in my office. Excellent. <laughs> <laughs> I eat in my office. You eat in your office, okay, but not during your work time, or yes? No. Ah, okay. Uh huh. I Lillian, any rules at your work? Mauricio, Laura, Zaira. There must be a lot of rules in the hotel. No, huh? wearing the, the uniform para decir no llegar sin el uniforme así. ah ok do not attend without uniform or wear uniform that's a rule wear okay. uniform ok ok don't shift the truck if the truck doesn't clean. Don't shift the truck if the truck doesn't shift uh, clean. Doesn't. Come on, Galileo, you can do it better than that. If the si el truck... camino no está limpio. Si el camión isn't. no está limpio. Isn't. Ah, clean. okay. Say it again, please. <laughs> Uh, don't chip the track if the track isn't clean. Okay. Thank you. Good. Uh -huh, Jonathan, turn on your camera, Jonathan. I don't want your camera off. You you go to do something else, okay? Nah, come on. Catherine, Dinora. Not heavy, not heavy romantic relaxation chip. Oh, oh, oh. With your purse. Okay, yeah, rules, okay? Don't have romantic relationships with your partners. Okay, good. So, rules at work. And what is the other question? Do you think it is important to follow rules? Dedito arriba o dedito abajo? Vamos a ver. Yes. Is it is important to follow rules? Yes. Uh -huh. Okay. Yeah, definitely. Another question, I think. Do you like all your company's rules? Yeah. No. Yes. <laughs> no. Uh, yes. Occasionally, yes. occasionally. Occasionally, I no. Love. Because yes, the discipline is really important to uh, reach the success. Okay, Mauricio, what rules you don't like occasionally? Yeah, what do you say? The form of sleep. Ah, occasionally. I Ok, aquí les doy un término que se usa, el, el código de vestir, ¿verdad? Eso se llama en inglés, ¿alguien sabe? Dress code. Dress code. Dress Thank code. you, Dinora. The dress code. Ok. Yeah. What is your dress code, uh, the dress code in your company, Mauricio? Uh, when this is the client, the client, generally the is 
obligación. Mandatory. Mandatory, mandatory uh, formal, formal cloth. Ah. And Do you have or, to wear a tie? Uh, yes, and uh, for el calor, uh, it, yeah, es incómodo. Yeah, it is uncomfortable, uncomfortable. Okay, good. Any other rule that you don't like at your workplace? No va a salir de aquí, no se preocupen. <laughs> ah? In my case, the internal direction is good. The only problem is that the 90% of my partners don't don't keep uh, every mandatory. Okay. And, and this is a problem uh, because uh, have problem uh, between the partner. Yeah, okay, good. So sometimes we don't like rules, but rules are important. Yeah, definitely rules provide protection. So we must see the rules not as prohibitions, but as protection. It's okay. Okay, very good. Now uh, let's take a look to the conversation for this lesson. Let me share the screen. Okay, it's a conversation between Sandra and Mr. Sia. Okay, let's see. Listen, uh, the first time just listen, okay? And actually I will record it. I will record it in WhatsApp. Mm -hmm. No, it's not this group, it's this group. Okay. Good morning, Mr. C. I want to know about the procedures with the new employee. Well, he cannot continue with us. I see. Is it because of what happened? Yes, he was caught smoking inside the company and it is not allowed. I understand. He knew the values of our company, so there is no excuse. And also, it is not allowed to sleep in work hours. You are right. It is not allowed to use the cell phone in work hours. Okay. Now, repeat after me, please. Uh, let me get this. Good morning, Mr. Sia. I want to know about the procedures with the new employee. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Well, he cannot continue with us. Well, well he no. cannot continue, 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 continue with us. Continue with us. I see. Is it because of what happened? I see. Is it because of what happened? Yes, he was caught smoking inside the company and it is not allowed. Yes, he was caught smoking inside the company and it is not allowed. I understand. He knew the values of our company, so there is no excuse. I understand. I understand. I understand. He knew the values of our company, so there is no excuse. And also, it is not allowed to sleep in work hours. And also, it is not allowed to sleep in work hours. You are right. It is not allowed to use the cell phone in work hours. 
Alright. Alright. So all of us are not used to work hours. Self-work hours. Self-work hours. Okay. Very good. Uh, some words. Look at this word. Procedures. Procedures. Okay. Procedures. Yes. Listen again. Procedures. 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 Okay. Procedures. Yes. Procedures. And this word. Allowed. 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 Mm -hmm. Okay. Very good. Now, you are Sandra and I am Mr. C. You, uh, no, I am Sandra and you are Mr. C. Okay, I begin. Good morning, Mr. C. I want to know about the procedures with the new employee. Well, well, he cannot continue with us. I see. Is it because of what happened? Yes, yes. yes. it was yes. Uh, uh, inside, inside the company. The company. company. And it, it is alone. not alone. I understand. He knew the values of our company, so there is no excuse. And also, it is not allowed to sleep in work hours. You're, You're right. right. Yes. It is also not allowed, not allowed. Not allowed. Not work to use the cell phone in work hours. hours. Okay. Now, you are Sandra and I am Mr. C. Okay, you begin. One, two, three. Good morning, morning, morning Mr. C. I want to know about, about, about the procedures, procedures, procedures the new with the new employee. employee. Well, he cannot continue with us. I see. I see. This is because, because of what happened. What happened. What happened? Yes, he was caught smoking inside the company and it is not allowed. You are right. It is not allowed to use the cell phone in work hours. Okay. Um, let me see. What is the pronunciation of this word? Out. Employee. Employee. Yes. So Employee. The, the stress is here. Employee. Employee. Okay. Employee. Uh, what else? Oh. What about this word? Caught. Huh? Yeah, caught. Oh. Out. Caught. 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 Yes, forget caught. about GH, okay? Caught. Caught. Yeah, caught. He was caught smoking. Uh huh. Uh, caught. The values, work hours, okay. Any question with the conversation? What? How say pro procedures? Proce yes. Procedures. Yes. Procedures. Okay. Thank you. Uh -huh. So this this is like you. Procedures. Yeah. Procedures. Procedures. Yes, procedures. Es como schedule. No decimos horario, ¿verdad? Schedule. Es igual ese sonido. Ju. Um, ah, esta otra. What is the pronunciation of, oops. 
this one. I understand. Uh -huh. I, um, well, I understand, understand, I understand, okay? I understand. Do you understand? Understand me, please. I don't understand. Yeah, understand. Okay. Okay, any other question? If not, I will send you to work in pairs, but there are also three questions here about the conversation. Okay, and you're going to respond them. Number one, what are some rules in Sandra's company. Number two, what is the problem with the new employee? And number three, are these rules similar to your companies? How? Okay. So in pairs, you are going to practice the conversation and respond these three questions. All right. Okay, let me form the groups. Oops, is this? One, two, three, four, seven groups. Yeah. Okay, I'll give you 10 minutes to practice the conversation practice okay if you want you can listen the the pronunciation you have the the voice message in whatsapp already with the conversation listen to the pronunciation and practice okay practice the intonation the pronunciation and respond the questions see you in around 10 minutes
Don't use, don't use cell phone in work hours. This is the other rules. Mm -hmm. And only that. Yes. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. And the second one is what is the problem with the new employee? Mm. Um, smoking. Uh -huh. He don't respect. What? He didn't what? respect the rules. Respect. What? Uh -huh. Oh, he was caught smoking. Be uh -huh. Mm. It is. It is not alone. Alone to sleep. Sleep in work. In work hours. In work hours. Correct. Sí. And. Oh. And no smoking. Mm -hmm. And. And we um, can no smoking. Mm. Oh, right. Okay, it is. It is. It is no. Ah, uh, he was caught smoking inside the company. Se vayaron fumando. Okay. It is, it is not. Oh, it is. Okay. Mm -hmm. It is not. It is not also. It is not. Oh, it is not. Hello. Hello. Mm. Hello, use the cell phone. Ah, pues ese sería the problem. Oh. La dos y la tres. Good morning. Okay, si gusta, yeah. empezamos ahora con, con la conversation. Eh, si gusta, okay. yo soy Sandra. Y usted es Mr. C. Ok. Good morning, Mr. C. Mr. C. I want to know about the procedures. Procedure. Como me había mencionado, teacher. The pronunciation de, is procured. Right. Procedures. Procedures. Okay. Good morning, Mr. C. Good morning, Mr. C. I want to know about the procedures with the new employee. And then when the the the, the quarantine is open and they take a decision to close offices because it's more more cheaper and uh, that the personal yeah, I stay at the home. Okay. Mm -hmm. and, and continue with the with okay. the problem. Um, are these rules rules similar to your company? How? Yes. Um, we have the rule to don't smoke, but problem with the, with the new employee, when you, you say the, uh, after they are one vowel, una vocal, you can say the, the, the apple, for example, but in this case, the sentence is, what is the problem with the new employee? 
the new employee, uh -huh. Uh -huh. The, the new employee uh, she can't keep into the rules company. No se mantiene dentro de las reglas de la compañía. He can't keep into the rules company. Maybe we can say, uh, we can express another way to say it, but that is, I, I think, <laughs> he can't keep into the rules company. Yeah. And esta vez yo soy Sandra. Good morning, Mr. She. I want to know about the procedure with the new employees. Procedures with the new employees. Well, he cannot continue with us. I see. It is because of what happened? Yes. He was cough and mocking inside the company and it is not allowed i understand he knew he knew he know teacher who who say knew okay i understand um sorry he, uh, i am sandra uh, i understand he knew yeah the, he knew Okay, the value of our company. So there is no excuse. And also, it is not allowed to sleep in work hours. You are right. It is also not allowed to use the cell phone in work hours. Okay, Brian, entonces, who says Mr. C or Sandra? Mr.
Okie dokie, welcome back. Okay. Galileo and Syrah, could you please read the conversation? Okay. It's a pleasure. You are Sandra, Syrah. Okay. Good morning, Mr. Sia. Go I want to know about the procedure with the new employee. Well, he cannot continue with us. I see. Is it because or what, or what happened? Yes, he was caught smoking inside the company and it is not allowed. I understand. He knew the values of your company. So there is no excuse. And also it is not allowed to sleep in work hours. You are right. It is also not allowed to use the cell phone in work hours. Okay. Very good. Thank you. Now, please, okay. Ana Lilian and Javier. <clears throat> okay. Uh, good morning, Mr. Sia. I want to know about the procedures with the new employee. Well, well, he cannot continue with with you with us. I see. It's because of what happened. Yes, he was caused smoking inside the company, and it is not allowed. Allowed. I understand. He knew the value of our company, so there is no excuse. And also, it is not allowed, allowed to sleep in war hours. You are right. It, it is also not allowed to use the cell phone in work house. Okay, very good. Thank you. Laura and Mary, please. Okay. Okay. Good morning, Mr. C. I I want to know about the procedures with the new employee. Well, he cannot continue with that. I see. It is because of what happened. Yes, he was caught smoking inside it, inside the company and it and it is not allowed. I understand. He knew the value of our company, so there is no excuse. And also it is not allowed to sleep in war hours. You are right. It is also not allowed to use the cell phone in work hours. Okay. Perfect. Thank you. Um, uh, let's continue with Catherine and Ivania. Okay. Good morning, Mr. C. I want to know about the procedures with the new employee. Well, he cannot continue with us. I see. Is, is it because of what happened? Yes, he was caught smoking inside the company and it is not allowed. I understand. He knows the values of our company. So there is, so is, there is no excuse. And also... It is not allowed to sleep in worse hours. You are right. 
You are right. It is also not allowed to the use the cell phone in work hours. Okay. Um, I'm going to take the second attendance and then we're going to continue. Ana Lilian Reyes. Present teacher. Okay, give me a moment. I need to stop sharing to see your faces. Okay. Brian Javier Carmona. Present. Okay. Uh, Dinor Alejandra Alfaro. Present teacher. Good. Frida Janine Mejia. Present teacher. Good. Javier Aldair Escobar. Present teacher. Great. Jose Arnoldo Mazariego. Present teacher. Great. Jose Galileo Barrera. Present. Great. Jose Jonathan Vigil. Present. Good. Jonathan, you have the session one-on-one -on -one tonight. Don't run away. Jose Rodrigo Hernandez. Didn't show up. Catherine Marcela Castaneda. Present teacher. Good. Laura Carolina Vigil. Present teacher. Good. Maria Concepcion Cerón. Present. Great. Maria Ivania Palma. Present teacher. Great. Mauricio Antonio Orellana. Present. Good. Mauricio Antonio Rivera. Ma Mayra Veralice Moreno. Rocío Lourdes, Zaira Marlene Larín. Present teacher. And Wendy Maribel Zabaleta. Present teacher. Perfect. Now let's continue with. Uh, Mauricio and Wendy. Okay. Okay, give me a moment. That's it. Oh. Thank you. There you are. Okay. Start. Start me. Yes. Okay. Good morning, Mr. C. I want to know about the pro procedures with the new employee. Well, he cannot continue with yours. I see. Is it is because of what happened? Yes, he was called smoking inside the company and it is not allowed. I understand. He knew the values of our company, so there is no excuse. And also, it is not alone to sleep in work hours. You're right. It is also not allowed, allowed to use the cell phone in work hours. Good, Ana Lilian and Javier. Javier, you want to play? Teacher. Uh huh. Uh, I have a lot. Sorry. Of... I apologize Sorry. for my uh, ignorant ignorance, but in, in Mr. C in the in the four paragraphs, Mr. C said he was caught. The verb to be is in past, and the verb in principal verb is in past too. Yeah. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, but no, I don't to be, be sorry. I know out. what I know. I know. Okay. Why? Because this is passive voice. That is something completely, completely different. Okay, he was caught. That is what we know as passive voice. Significa él fue atrapado. Yeah. Fue atrapado. 
Eso se llama passive voice. Siempre vamos a usar el verbo to be y el verbo en pasado. Aún cuando estemos hablando eh, en presente. Por ejemplo, si, porque ahí fue, y él fue atrapado. Eh, tú estás atrapado. Sería, you are caught. ¿Verdad? Tú estás atrapado. ¿Ya? Entonces, esta es otra forma verbal. Yeah. ¿Ya? Cuando hablo de algo que yo hice en el pasado, simple past. Ok. Thank uh -huh. you. Ok. Well, good question. Ok. Uh, ¿Quiénes dije? Ana Lilian y Javier, ¿verdad? Sí. Ok, go ahead. Let me show you. Puede presentar el libro, por favor. Claro, claro. Ahorita, ahí está. Ok. Ok. Uh, Me gusta cambiemos ahora. Porque, ok. Pues Sofía, cambia. Good morning, Mr. Cia. I want to know about the procedure with the new employee. Well, he cannot continue with us. I see. It is because of what happened. Yes, he was caught smoking inside the company and it is not allowed. You understand, he, he need the values of our company, so there is no excuse. And also, it is not allowed to sleep in work house. You are right. It is also not allowed. allowed. They used to solve for in work hours. Okay, very good. And um, next would be Galileo and Syra. Yes. Okay. Uh, yes. Yes. Uh, yes. 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 Good, good morning, Mr. Sia. I want to know about the procedures with the new employee? Well, he cannot continue with us. I see. Is it because of what happened? Yes, he was caught smoking inside the company and it is not allowed. I understand. He knew the values of our company. So there is no excuse. And also it is not allowed to sleep in work hours. You are right. It is also not allowed to use the cell phone in work hours. Okay, and, and now Brian and Dinora. Brian. Okay. Good morning, Mr. C. I want to know about the procedures with the new employee. Well, he cannot continue with use. I see. Is it because of what happened? Yes, he was called smoking inside the company and it is not allowed. I understand. He knew the values of our company, so there is no excuse. And also, it is not allowed to sleep in work hours. You're right. It is also not allowed to use the cell phone in work hours. Okay. And now, Frida, choose your partner, Brian or Dinora? Dinora. Okay. Uh, good morning, Mr. C. I want to know about the procedures 
with the new employee? Well, he cannot continue with us. I see. It is because of what happened. What happened? Yeah. Yes. He was caught smoking inside the company and it is not allowed. I understand. He knew the value the, the values of our company. So there is no excuse. And also it is not allowed to sleep in work hours. You are right. It is also not allowed to use the cell phone in work hours. Okay, very good. Thank you, people. Okay, let me do something before we continue because it's a difficulty with some words again. Uh, okay. Give me a moment. Procedures, procedures. The other is caught, caught. The other is allowed, allowed. Basically. Okay, practice, practice those words, okay? You have them in WhatsApp there to, to listen many, many times until you do it well. Okay, well, we have, there are three questions. Um, so what are some rules in Sandra's company? Tell me. Don't <laughs> okay. Tell Frida. <laughs> uh, don't smoke. Okay. Don't, don't sleep. Uh huh. And don't use the cell phone in work hours. Okay. Very good. Anything else, people? No. No. What is the problem with the new employee? Come on, he's a new employee and he got fired. What is the problem with the new employee? The new employee, he was called smoking inside smoke. the, the company and this is no, is uh, allowed. Allowed. Uh, yeah, allowed. Allowed. Okay, good. Uh, he was caught smoking. Um, are these rules similar to your companies? Yes or no? You have those rules? Not, yes. Do not smoke. Yes. Do yes. not sleep. Yes. Same do not use yourself. a cell phone. Yes. yes. Okay. Can we include do not sleep in class? <laughs> okay I know you are tired that we have been working a lot but you are young okay so now let's take a look to I know uh, yes you are young people okay we let me show be do we need Two big cup of coffee. Okay, get a cup of coffee early before the class. Strong coffee. Yes. Okay, let's take a look. So, how to use it's not allowed? How to use it's not allowed? Use it's not allowed to talk about prohibitions that we have in a particular place. Prohibitions, okay? Prohibition. It is not allowed to smoke inside the facilities. It is not allowed to take tools home. It is not allowed to drink alcoholic beverages. It is not allowed to use cell phones. 
It is not allowed to sleep in working hours. It is not allowed to run in any area of the company. Okay, some things are prohibited. Now, repeat after me, please. It is not allowed to smoke inside the facilities. It is not allowed to take tools home. It is, it is not allowed, not allowed to, take to take tools home. It is not allowed to drink alcoholic beverages. It is not allowed to drink alcoholic beverages. What does it mean beverage? Drinks. Drinks. Drink. Yes, alcoholic Drink. beverages. Bebidas espirituosas. Alcoholic beverages. Bebidas espirituosas. <laughs> <laughs> It is not allowed to use cell phones. It is not allowed, allowed to, to allow use cell phones. cell phones. It is not allowed to sleep in working hours. It is not allowed to sleep in working hours. It is not allowed to run in any area of the company. It is it not, not allowed, allowed to run in any area of the company. The company. Of the company. Okay. Any question with this? Okay. So we can use this in different with different subjects and different forms. Por ejemplo, aquí dice no está permitido. ¿Verdad? Fumar dentro de las instalaciones. Ok. Facilities son instalaciones. No está permitido. Eh, ¿Cómo diríamos no tienes permitido fumar dentro de las instalaciones. ¿Cómo podríamos decir eso? No tienes. Se los voy a poner más fácil. Tú no tienes permitido. O tú no estás permitido. No lo decimos así, pero para guiarles para darles una clave you can? no mm. you should? you shouldn't? no si, si, tenemos que usar esta misma estructura parecida démosle forma de acuerdo al, al, al sujeto ya me dijeron por ahí mm. you vaya you are not allowed, not allowed. are not uh, allowed, allowed. Are not allowed uh -huh. to smoke inside no. No. the facilities. Man, you are not allowed. No te está permitido. O él, tú no tienes permitido. ¿Verdad? ¿Cómo dirías? Él no tiene permitido fumar dentro de las instalaciones. Is not allowed. He is not allowed. Okay. He is not allowed. He is not allowed. ¿Verdad? No tenemos permitido. We are not allowed. Yes, we are not allowed. To smoke inside the facilities. A ver. Yo no tengo permitido. Uh -huh. I, am, I, am not. I am not allowed. 
Okay. Y así sucesivamente, ¿verdad? Ustedes no tienen permitido. ¿Cómo sería? They are. No. And usted. We are. You are. You are. No, there are. Alone. You. Acuérdense que ustedes <laughs> es igual que tú. You are not allowed. Ellos no tienen permitido. They are. ¿Cómo? They are, teacher. Exacto. They are not allowed. Okay. okay. Y esto eh, lo podemos usar en pasado. A ver. Yo sé que, 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 que saben. Solo es de aprender a armar y a usar las mismas piezas que ya conocemos. Va, imagínense. ¿Cómo dirían? Yo. O, o tú. Vaya, usemos, démosle, cambiemos esta, por ejemplo, al pasado. Sería, ajá. Presente, you well, are not allowed to smoke inside the facilities. Pasado. Well, You Exacto. were not alone. Exacto. Solo cambiamos el to be al pasado. ¿Ve? Tú no tenías permitido. Es así le dicen. Tú no tenías permitido hacer eso, ¿verdad? Tú no tenías permitido. ¿Ok? Y así todo. O sea, ¿qué vamos a cambiar? Solo el esto. El to be. Él no tenía permitido. ¿Cómo sería? ¿Cómo He sería él? Él no tenía permitido. He was. He was. He was, yes. was not. He was not allowed. ¿Ya? Y así sucesivamente. ¿Ok? Not allowed. Y en futuro. Take it easy. El futuro no lo hemos visto todavía. Ya, ya con estos dos me van a hacer bolas. ¿no? El futuro todavía no lo hemos visto bien. Ok. Ok. So, it is not allowed. I am not allowed. You are not allowed. Vale. Voy a copiar esta pantalla para ponérselas ahí. Aquí, aquí. Okay. Now, um, what time is it? Okay. Voy a poner un, un ejercicio que tengo por acá. Okay, this exercise. So in this exercise, you only have to pair. Yeah. Smoking not allowed. En, en qué lugar estas prohibiciones tienen lugar? Yo solo. Hospital. ¿Verdad? Para emparejar acá. Smoking not allowed at dawn. the park, library, hospital, exam room, museum, airplane, zoo, or forest. Hospital. 
hospital, ¿verdad? Yeah. Definitely. Vamos a ver dónde está. Para poner el numerito. Hospital. Vamos a poner el number. No, hospital, hospital, hospital. Number one. Ok. Photography not allowed. Where? In museum. Museum. Muy bien. Museum. Museum. Calculators not allowed. Exam room. Exam room. Yeah. Number three. Large bags not allowed. Airplane. Airplane, yes. Feeding not allowed. What is feeding? To food. Huh? Alimentar. Alimentar. Dar de comer. The zoo. The zoo, yes. Pero hay mandándole churritos a los a los monos. Okay. Talking not allowed. Library. Library. Yes. Number six. Dogs not allowed. Or park. Park. Raro, ¿verdad? Pero bueno. And Campfires not allowed. ¿Qué es, un, ¿Qué es un campfire? Um, fogata. Fogata. No son allowed en el forest. ¿Qué es un forest? Bosque. Bosque, Bosque ¿verdad? Vaya. A ver, a ver. Ok, ahora les voy a copiar esto y me van a hacer una oración por cada cosa. Por ejemplo, vaya. Smoking. No, que ya está ya. Smoking, smoking, ¿dónde está? ¿Qué es un hizo? Vaya. Armemos la oración de smoking. Smoking, smoking. Acuérdense aquí, ¿verdad? No es smoking. Smoking is not allowed. Ya como estamos armando la oración, agregamos el verbo to be. Donde dijimos en the hospital. ¿Ya? Esto es lo que quiero que hagan. ¿Verdad? Una oración para cada caso. Cuidado cuando están las cosas en plural. Por ejemplo, calculators, dogs, large bags. Cuidado, ¿ok? Any question with the activity? No. Clear. No. No. Basta con que le dije que tenga cuidado. Teacher. Este. Eh, question, teacher. Hola. El, el, en este caso, fumar no está permitido en el, en el hospital. Eh, la ordenó de esa manera. Pero si usted lo quisiera poner en la forma que it is no. Smog. A low smog, o sea, el verbo después, no antes, in the hospital, también se podría. O sea, el orden de la oración. ¿Cómo sería? Eh, it, 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 is, it is not allowed eh, to smog in the hospital. Yes, así sí. 
o sea, podría ajá, pasar el verbo uh, a, al pasado también. Bueno, no, eh, no, ah, no, no. Me <risa> <risa> confundí ahí, Tiche. Ah, pero iba sí. Iba bien, iba bien. <risa> es, eso solo por decirlo, ese es el infinity. To smoke. Oh, ¿Verdad? Okay. Acuérdense que siempre que lleva el to es el infinitivo. Ah, ok, ok, teacher. To smoke. Sí, está, estaría bien si usted quiere hacerlo, ¿verdad? Pero si no, okay. no se complique la vida. Póngalo yeah. como está aquí. ¿Cómo? <risa> ok, está bien, teacher. Solo agregue el verbo to be, como lo vimos ahí, ¿verdad? Smoking is not allowed in the hospital. The hospital, ok. O in a hospital. Okay, teacher. Gracias. Photography uh, uh, allowed in tal lugar. Okay. 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 Eh, bueno, tenemos poco tiempo. Ya les expliqué lo que van a hacer. Volvamos a, las, a los grupos. Y lo hacen. Ay, ¿qué pasó? ¿Dónde lo puse? Ahí está.
large bags are not allowed. Lar large, large bags are not allowed in the airplane. In the... Mm -hmm. You say the because uh, the first... Uh, the first yes. after the preposition da. the is vowel. Tampoco suena da. Duena, suena oh. di, in the, in di. the airplane. Exactly. Airplane. In the airplane. airplane. ¿Cómo se pronuncia? Airplane. Airplane. Como que diga e i r Airplane. Airplane. Mm -hmm. Ok. Sería large bags are not allowed. Allowed in, in the, the airplane. airplane. Yeah. Number five, feeding is not allowed. Feeding is ice. In the, in the food, in the soup. Hello, teacher. Hello, what happened? Who was your partner? Mm, I don't know um, when you sent uh, to room, uh, break a room, say break a room. No, I don't know what happened. Okay. Let me send you to another group. I were alone. I were alone in sentences okay I uh, will send you to group number five, okay? Help them. Teacher. Yes. Este, si es plural, eh, uh -huh. en vez de is sería are. Correct. Me saluda, la tenía atravesada. <laughs> Por eso quería el ejemplo y no me lo dio. No, a ver, porque usted sabe. <laughs> sí sabe. Vaya, eh, en esta de, de la tres eh, sería calcular calcular tours uh, are not allowed allow en mm -hmm. de Ex, exam room. Okay. Is correct? Yes, yes it is. Okay. okay. Ah, pues sí sé. Sí pasé bien, sí pasé bien en matemáticas. <laughs> <laughs> okay, see you. See you. It's not allowed. Allow it. In, in the zoo. In the zoo, yes. The talking, talking is not, is not allowed. Hello. Talking. Okay. Library. Not in the allowed. library. Is not okay, allowed. I see. In. 
Talking is not allowed <coughs> in the library. In the library. Uh, in the library. Library. The library. Library. Las siete sería dogs are not allowed. Dogs are not allowed. Dogs, varios son. Dogs are. Ah, are. sí, sí. Dogs are. Yes. There are no allowed. In the park. park. In the park. Yes. Yeah. Qué raro. Yeah. Yeah. Smoking is not. Photography is not. Calculator are not. Calculators are not. Large bag are not. Um, feeding is not, is not, Simo. Alone, I'm not alone in the soup. Talking is, it does. Ya hicimos la tarea, teacher. Oh, ok, perfecto. Ahí solo estamos revisando. Teacher, eh... we finish. Ok. Excellent. Las tareas. Ajá. <laughs> perfect, perfect. Yes, teacher, we finish the sentences. Ok, we are almost done. Okay, yeah. it's time. It's all time to stop. Okay. Okay. See you in a moment. Realizado. Ahí viene el pitch. Hello, teacher. Pero no, o sea, no sé cómo es que puede analizar eso si yo sin multa o algo así o, o, o sea decíame eso desde ya hi teacher hello how are you oh I'm doing good I'm great fabulous fabulous <laughs> Excellent. Yes, definitely. Amazing. <laughs> so, the Nora is not allowed to eat Pizza Hut. Or yes. No. no. <laughs> I don't like it, so. Oh, yeah, you have to say that. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay, people, welcome back. It's time to stop tonight. Let me take the last attendance of the day. Okay. And tomorrow we are going to practice a little bit more about this. Huh, some of you already left. Okay, Anna Lilian Reyes. Present teacher. Thank you for attending. Good night. Brian Good night. Javier Carmona. Is gone. Dinor Alejandra Alfaro. Present teacher. Thank you for attending. See you tomorrow. Bye. Frida Janine Mejia. Present teacher. Okay, good night, Frida. See you tomorrow. Good night. Javier Aldair Escobar. Your teacher. Thank you, Javier. See you tomorrow. See you. Jose Arnoldo Mazariego. He's gone. Jose Galileo Barrera. Good night, teacher. Good night, Galileo. 
Jose Jonathan Vigil. Present. Good. See you later. Jose Rodrigo Hernandez. Catherine Marcela Castaneda. Present teacher. Thank you for attending. See you tomorrow. Laura Carolina Vigil. Present teacher. Thank you, Laura. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow, teacher. Maria Concepcion Cerón. Present teacher. Okay, Mary, have a good night. See you tomorrow. Good night. Maria Ivania Palma. Present teacher. Thank you for attending, Mary. See you tomorrow. Mauricio Antonio Orellana. Present. Okay, Mauricio, have a good night. Bye bye. Uh, Saira Marleni Larin. Present teacher. Good, good night, Saira. Thank you for coming. And Wendy Maribel Tabaleta. Present teacher. Good night. Good night, teacher. Wendy. Blessings. Blessings. Teacher. Yes. Antes de irme, quería hacerte una consulta. Dime. Fíjese que en el examen, porque lo estaba realizando, no pude contestar la pregunta de la tarea. No me coincide en el examen y es la misma respuesta. En el examen, ¿cuál examen? En el examen de que nos toca hoy. No me de... acuerdo dónde lo anoté. Ah, no el de midterm. Sí, pero lo anoté y no sé dónde lo anoté. Pero... Ay. Buscarlo y me decís qué ejercicio es. Me... Se, lo, se, se lo mando por el chat. Sí. Para no quitarle los minutos ahí a, a Jonathan. Sí, este muchacho está deseoso. Okay. <risa> Good night. Chao, Jonathan. Good night. Pasó Jonathan. ¿Qué tal, teacher? Es cierto que el lunes, el viernes se quedó buscando. Pues sí. No, que no le escuché bien o no le entendí. Andaba, andaba medio, medio sordo. Ah, vaya, vaya, pues te vamos sí, a creer. Sí, sí, por esa parte el, el, el jueves. <coughs> uh -huh. Ah, se estaba mal del oído. Decía. Sí, fui a pasar consulta el jueves, uh -huh. como a las seis y media. Y ya sabe cómo es el seguro, ¿verdad? Ah, sí, sí, sí. Es de ir con mucha paciencia. Sí. <risa> ok, entonces hagamos una cosa. Por lo menos revisemos un poco lo de esos días. Ok. Vamos a ver qué fue. Vamos a buscar acá. Vamos. ¿Qué vimos? Creo que fueron estas. There is y there are. There is y there are. Mm -hmm. Let's practice the conversations. Okay. okay. Okay, listen, I'm going to read it first. My name is Tom. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. I'm Orson. I work for Hodge. Oh, I know that company. There is an office in San Salvador downtown. Yes, we're growing, so there are not many branches in the country yet. There are few. What company do you work for? I work for Eco, the painting company. There are 25 branches in the country. That's great. I visited one of the stores the other day. Yeah, there are six in San Salvador. We are planning on launching one in Santa Ana these days. There isn't one yet. <clears throat> okay, now you repeat after me, please. Okay. My name is Tom. Nice to meet you. 
My name is Tom. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. I'm Orson. I work for Hodge. Nice to meet you too. I'm Orson. I work for Hodge. Oh, I know that company. There is an office in San Salvador downtown. Oh, I know that company. There is an office in San Salvador downtown. Yes, we're growing. So there are not many branches in the country yet. There are few. What company do you work for? Yes, we're growing. So there are not many branches in the country yet. There are few. What company do you work for? I work for Eco, the painting company. There are 25 branches in the country. I work for Eco, the painting company. There are 25 branches in the country. That's great. I visited one of the stores the other day. That's great. I visited one of the store the other day. Yeah, there are six in San Salvador. Yeah, there are six in San Salvador. We are planning on launching one in Santa Ana these days. There isn't one yet. We are planning on launching one in Santa Ana this day. There isn't one yet. Okay, any question with this conversation? Um, no. Okay, so let's practice one more time. Now you are Tom, no, I am Tom and you are Orson, okay? Okay. I begin. My name is Tom, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too, I am Orson. I work for Hodge. Oh, I know that company. There is an office in San Salvador downtown. Yes, we're growing. So there are not many branches in the country yet. There are a few. What company do you work for? I work for Eco, the painting company. There are 25 branches in the country. That's great. I visit one of the store the other day. Yeah, there are six in San Salvador. We're planning on launching one in Santa Ana this day. There isn't one yet. Okay, good. Only pay attention to this word, okay? How, does, how do okay. you pronounce this? Great. Okay, it's great. Great. Yeah, great. 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 Okay. Okay. Great. Great. Okay. Now you are Tom. You begin. Okay. My name is Tom. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. I'm Orson. I work for Hodge. Oh, I know that company. There is an office in San Salvador downtown. Yes, we're growing. So there are not many branches in the country yet. There are few. What company do you work for? I work for Eco, the painting company. There are 25 branches in the country. That's great. I visited one of the stores the other day. Yeah, there are six in San Salvador. We are planning on launching one in Santa Ana these days. There isn't one yet. Okay, another question. What is the meaning of launching? Launching, um, almuerzo? Nope. Um, Elisa, we are planning on launching one in Santa Ana these days uh, in el almuerzo no lunch no no, no tiene lunch. nada que ver no, con, con almuerzo no, si sí es si sí es como reunión como encuentro creo no lunch es 
lanzar, pero lanzar como de eh, iniciar algo, arrancar algo, comenzar algo. Lanzamiento. Ejemplo, sí, un lanzamiento. Incluso se usa. Como una inauguración, como una inauguración sí. Como... Sí, sí, puede ser. Planning and ¿Verdad? Eso es un término que se usa incluso cuando es el lanzamiento de los cohetes al espacio, ¿no? Eso se llama launching. También. Yo sé que están planeando lanzar una tienda, me imagino, en Santana esos días. Exacto, esa es la idea. Porque no hay, ni, no hay una aún. Exacto. ¿Verdad? Okay. Esa es la idea. We are planning... Uh, launching one in Santa Ana. Mm -hmm. Launching. ¿Cómo se pronuncia? On launching. Launching. We are planning on launching. We are planning on launching. 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 Mm -hmm. Launching. 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 ¿Verdad? Okay. ¿Qué era branches? ¿Te acordás que son branches? Sí, es con um, sucursales. Correcto, muy bien, muy bien. ¿Qué es downtown? Uh, como el centro. Muy bien. Ok. Por decir el centro histórico. Sí, el centro, ¿verdad? De una ciudad. Yes. Ok, Jonathan. Bueno, no sé si tenés alguna duda, alguna pregunta de alguna no, cosa. No, ninguna. No. Nothing. Vale, entonces nos quedamos acá porque ya es hora. Ok, thank you. Ok, good night. Good night. Jonathan. Bye bye. Bye.